Hi, this is Jeremiah Israel, and this is the Jeremiah Report. That's right, the Jeremiah Report. You know, check this out, man. Crazy ass women nowadays, man. I mean, damn. You take a look at this girl. She look like something. She got beat with an ugly stick. <laughs> Unfreaking believable. What this woman did was unfreaking believable. I mean, damn. I don't know. It's some kind of some kind of psychological terminology for that, for what she did. Uh, um, I don't know what it is, but I know one thing. What she did was ridiculous. This woman threw oil on her whole damn family. <laughs> Okay, her whole family cooking oil. Her whole damn family burnt her father, burnt her mother, and burnt her child. That's right. I don't know what it is. Is it a trend to be doing things like killing or maiming family members, just waiting to go to jail and waiting to see your name in the newspaper? You're a goddamn ugly ass motherfucker. I uh, goddamn, your life is that freaking low that you gotta do something out of the extraordinary to get on TV. <laughs> Yo, y'all, y'all out there, man. Out there, this woman is off the chain, real, on the real. I don't know, man. I have real, I have real concerns about what the, what this world is going to. This woman is out there busted, busted as nothing can be, and she threw oil on her family members, including her child. And you know what she did after that? She went in the room, sat down, waited for the cops. And did not even move. Did not have no motion or nothing like that. It must have, must had a lot of cooking oil on that shit, man. <laughs> really, a lot of damn cooking oil. I mean, damn. She look like she's toasted. You know what I'm saying? Toasted. Man, shit. And she got a kid. It's like some people out there don't deserve to have kids, man. I'm telling you, man, I'm telling you, y'all got to stop that shit, man. Y'all got to stop that shit because cause the government is going to come down on our asses because they're already taking the guns. <clears throat> they're going to come down on our asses and start snatching up our kids. If they can take away the Second Amendment and possibly the First Amendment and all Third Amendment and the Fifth Amendment, man, shit. You give you, you. What happens when you give a, a mouse a cookie? <laughs> he gonna want another one, and another one, and another one. That's as simple as that. Y'all gonna have real rights torn out from under you, and to the point that they, they take the second amendment, the third amendment, fourth, fourth, and next thing you know, it's like automatic. Oh shit, I gotta take the fifth amendment. Nobody gonna fucking say anything. It's ridiculous. Y'all brothers and sisters. Got to stop doing what you're doing, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Or don't have kids. Or don't be in, in a place that you don't like. You know? It's off the chain. Don't be in a place that you don't like. Or don't be miserable. You know what I'm saying? And you making other people's lives miserable. Because you want to get on TV. Oh, my God. Your life is that bad. You want to get on TV. <clears throat> See yourself on the news. Have everybody know your face. What kind of madness are we dealing with here? I, I don't know what to tell you, man. But I know one thing. Y'all girls are losing your mind. It's like every month is like some baby some baby family thing. It's like a baby bites the dust again because you throwing oil on them or, or, or some shit like that. 
drowning them or baking them in some kind of fucking goddamn microwave and shit. What, I mean, black women mind has been slowly degrading and I'm not saying no black woman's mind is slowly slowly degraded in this nation slowly sometimes I think I'm the only sane person on the planet but it's slowly degraded their mindset ever since the 70s it's been degrading in every way but all the focus on her but at the same time this woman is miserable I mean sometimes they, I, I just don't know what will make you throw hot oil on your family members it had to be a lot of oil you know what I'm saying off the freaking chain I think uh I think personally I think I think uh um um the reason for the heightened violence in the nations is cuz these crazy ass psychotropic drugs they giving out nowadays. I mean damn. I mean they actually it's like pharmaceutical grade fucking loop. It will drive you insane if you take if you get a prescription pill nowadays. One day you get an inscription pill, the next day you shooting up a whole fucking school or throwing oil on your family members. Okay? And as simple as that. People got psychiatric problems and shit like that. I don't believe it's the guns that should be taken off. I think these I think uh these drugs should be taken off the shelves. I agree. But how did this country been found? By what? How maintain by guns? You can't take away. You can't take away something like the guns in this country, because it will, I mean America wouldn't be the same. But anyway, now ladies, you gotta stop killing your kids. You gotta stop maiming your girlfriend. You gotta stop maiming your kids. You gotta stop maiming family members. And just went in the room and sat down and chilled and didn't move. Madness. Straight up freaking madness. This is Jeremiah Israel, and this is the Jeremiah Report. <laughs>